Hello, everybody. I don't see anybody on here yet. I see some people. Hi. My name is John Holiday, and I am a counter tenor, um, opera singer, and I sing a little bit of jazz and a little bit of gospel. And we are having some crazy, crazy times in the entire world. And one of the things that I love being able to do is being able to bring you just a little bit of joy and some light. As I always tell people in these things, I'm playing for myself. I'm not the most amazing pianist, so you will hear some mistakes and you'll probably hear some mistakes in the music. But most importantly, I want to be here for you guys in, in this, this crazy weird time because even though it's crazy it doesn't mean that we can't show love and it doesn't mean that we can't give joy so hopefully uh, I'll be able to do that for you again my name is John Holiday and if you can I think my, my page is tagged to this like my page too because this stuff happens more often on my page so I hope you're having a good day and um, I'll start with summertime because I wish it were summer you know I, I like uh, some warm weather where I live at I live in Wisconsin and it is very cold, and I'm looking forward to some heat. So hopefully I can bring you a little heat with this piece.
I'm taking a drink. My favorite drink is a Moscow Mule. I've had to hurry up and make it before I started this. Um, and I'm gonna take a sip. Just want to say if you guys have any questions or any comments or anything like that throughout the the live stream, I hope that you'll that you'll share and I'll try to answer them. Like I was saying, I live uh, I live in Wisconsin, I live in Appleton, Wisconsin. It's about mm, an hour and a half from Milwaukee, two and a half hours from Chicago and Green Bay. But anyway, this is where I reside, and I like some of you. I'm on a uh, Quarantine. In fact, I'm on a mandated quarantine, not because I'm sick, but because as an artist, I travel quite a bit. And uh, before I came back home, I was in France. Uh, I was in France working on a production of Xerxes, where I was the title role at Opera, uh, Opera de Rouen. Uh, we ended up having to cancel the production because we all came back um, to our places of residence. I was the only American. Uh, most everyone else was European, uh, but it was a lot of fun doing the production. Um, an incredible cast of people with beautiful, beautiful, beautiful spirits. But today I am on day eleven, day eleven of fourteen. So I'm not going stir crazy because I kind of like being at home. Sometimes I don't like being at home and not having a job, but. I do enjoy being at home, being around my dogs, and being around people in, in, in the city because it's quite a nice city. Um, later on, I'll give you some information because uh, I am also a person who is on the front lines of this uh, charity called the American, sorry, the Artist Relief Tree, which I think is quite extraordinary. It was founded by um, two of my friends who saw a need to create a way for the artists to um, be able to sustain themselves outside of this this incredible tragedy that we're all facing right now. Uh, Morgan Brophy and Andrew Crooks, who are two of my dearest friends, uh, and I collaborate often with Andrew, so it was really beautiful to be able to see their hearts um, turn into something so beautiful. So if you get a moment, in fact, my birthday is next Tuesday. One of the best ways to give to me right now is by giving to some other people, uh, giving to other artists. It doesn't matter if you're a dancer, an actor, a painter, a singer, whatever kind of artist you are, if you know someone who is without a job or you know who is struggling right now, please give to this, uh, give to the Arts Tree, um, Artist Relief Tree. I think it's an, an excellent, excellent um, organization and charity where you know for sure that you're your funds are going to someone who is desperately in need. All right, let's see here. This next piece, and again, my name is John Holiday. I'm a countertenor, I'm an opera singer. I sing a little bit of jazz and a little bit of gospel music, but I like to just say I'm an artist. I, I am extremely blessed to be able to share my gift with each of you. I believe that, that that's one of my duties in the world, especially when things are so crazy, is to share just a little bit of love. You can follow me at John Holiday Live uh, on Facebook and also on uh, Instagram, John Holiday Live. This is Hotel uh, by Poulenc, and it literally talks about uh, the room taking the form of a cage and this person all, all he or she wants to do is just lounge in the room and smoke so I don't want to smoke I'm not a smoker but all I want to do is be able to go outside and drive my car and and see things but this is kind of why I chose to sing this piece and there will definitely be mistakes in this so just get ready but enjoy anyway <laughs> Thank you. 
guys are saying, so I'm getting a little bit closer. Hey, Morgan. Hey, Marco. Hey, Emma. Um, thanks for tuning in. Yeah. This is a very, very, very interesting time, I know, for everyone. It seems like everything has come to a screech... Well, it has. Everything has come to, like, a screeching halt. Um, and I can understand how you all must be feeling. Even though I like being at home, I don't like being able to not see people. I love being around other folks. And I thrive off of other people's energy. So I can imagine how some of you are feeling uh, out there in the world. So all I can tell you is just to hold on, hang on tight, and, um, sorry, but there we are, and really hold on to the people that you love. There are so many ways in which you can make a difference right now. I know it seems like you probably can't, but you can by giving, by, by sharing a smile and a nod or just by being a kind, compassionate person. I think that that's part of what's needed right now too is so much more kindness and compassion is needed. Um, and I want to say already to anyone out there who is listening who has um, lost a loved one that my thoughts and my prayers are with you. I know that sometimes that that's not enough, but right now that's what I can offer to you is my, my love, my thoughts, my prayers, and my sincerest um, condolences to you and your family. And hopefully the music that I'm singing today will bring you some joy. Really, really, I hope it does. It will not replace your loved one, but hopefully it'll bring you some, some kind of joy that you can take with you today. Then this is one of my favorite, um, one of my favorite prayers, Ave Maria, by uh, Johann Sebastian Bach and and Gounod. So hopefully you'll you'll like that. This is Ave Maria, but it's not the Ave Maria that everybody knows. It's an Ave Maria that I think is quite extraordinary too in its own right. So I'll do that a little bit for you. <coughs> <coughs> For, for chiming in and being with me today. Um, that's one of my favorite pieces that, that I was taught as a little kid. 
and it brings me quite a bit of joy to be able to bring it back to you. Um, some of the ways that I'm coping with, uh, with being in, inside right now is that I'm literally spending so much time with my dogs and uh, with, with many people that I love being on a virtual, you know, like Zoom or FaceTime or I also have students so I try to call them every other day or every two days to check in with them just to see how they're feeling and how they're going through this because it's tough, I'm sure, for many people. I'm also trying to spend this time to be as creative as I can be and also to send as much love and light that I can. There are moments in there where I have, um, I'm not always my best self. I can say that too. Sometimes I, I uh, is it regress or something like that. You know, sometimes I have things where I go backward. But when I think of those moments where I feel like I'm going backward, it's an opportunity for me to learn how to continue to lead with love and light. So I hope that you guys are able to do that too in your, your living and your, your daily example of what it means to be a good human being. Um, again, my name is John Holiday. I'm a countertenor from the opera world. I also sing a little bit of jazz and a little bit of gospel, but mostly I'm just a human being. Uh, I'm going through the exact same things that you are. And as I was sharing earlier, I'm on a mandated, um, a mandated quarantine, but not because I'm sick, only because I was in France. Uh, so there's nothing wrong with me. I'm totally fine. Uh, in fact, what I have to say is that in spite of the craziness, like the actual CDC does send out a daily twice uh, email link for me to check in with them to see how I'm doing. So I'm always shocked that they are actually following through with that. They were calling and now it's just an email. So I have to do that. I take my temperature twice a day. Uh, I've been cooking a lot. And I've actually been sitting here at the piano a lot. Of, right now, I'm learning a, a gospel piece. Um, can't give you any more of that right now. I'll give you some more of that later. But I'm learning that uh, to do with some of my friends in the, in the opera world. Um, we're thinking of something to do, so... Uh, working on that <clears throat> and also working to create more beauty, working to create a, a CD and, and things like that. You know, as I was saying earlier, I don't want anything. The only thing I want for you to do is if you if you have the kindness in your heart is to share with the Artist Relief Tree. They are an incredible organization founded by my friends Morgan Brophy and Andrew Crooks and now Marco Camarota, Camarota is in there as well uh, with some of my other friends. Uh, who are who are leading the uh, the charge with trying to make a difference in people's lives, especially those who are artists. If you know an artist, send them some love, please. You have no idea what this is doing to them. Uh, so many people are struggling because they've lost work due to the um, due to a clause called force majeure, which is in most artists' contracts that you guys, the public, generally don't know about. But there are artists who are really struggling. So if you can find, and I mean struggling where they may not be able to find another meal or pay their rent or they don't know where things are coming from. So I really encourage you and implore you, if you can find it in your heart, give. If it's just a dollar, a dollar is better than nothing. Uh, but give to the artist tree, the artist relief tree. Okay, here we go. This is one of the songs that I, that I very first learned when I was in elementary school. In fact, it was my very first solo. Uh, Let There Be Peace on Earth. I usually sing it at Christmas time, but I think that it totally is appropriate right now. So I'm going to sing it. I haven't sung it in a very, 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 very long time. But I think if we could allow peace and love to be the leader, especially in times like this, the world would be a much better place. Um, I want to send you all the love that I can, so hopefully I can do that in this piece as well. <laughs>
always sing because I, I don't know, I, I always feel such a connection to that piece. I grew up singing it every Sunday in church, uh, and I want to share it with you, and I hope that it makes some difference in, in your life. And thank you so much for, for joining me today. And if you can find it in your heart, share this with everyone that you know. Um, I always have believed if it's one person or one thousand or one million, I sing the same way I would sing to one to all uh, in hopes that it will just change someone's life. So I hope that my singing today has made your day brighter and that um, you continue to think of ways to be a light in this world which is so, which is so desperately craving everyone's light right now. So use your light for good. some joy to you. 
Don't forget that all it takes is kindness. Kindness doesn't cost a thing. Just be kind to your neighbor, kind to a stranger. We all need it right now. And even though I don't know all of you who are tuning in, I love you. I love you for who you are. I love you for just being a human being. You were born and so you're worthy to be loved. And so if no one's told you that today, I love you. And if no one else has told you, I hope that you're doing well. And if no one else has told you, I know you're going to do well. Take care of yourselves and be kind to one another. See you next time. Follow me on my pages, uh, John Holiday Live. Um, that's my Instagram and also my Facebook. Please follow me and share this with everybody you know. And don't forget, give to the Artist Relief Tree. Every artist that you know, give them a hug. Send them, send them as much love as you can. Have a fantastic day. Bye.